Hey everyone, it's Rena Jada with the Health Boot Camps and the Live Longer Podcast. And we've got today Liliana Partita, who's going to talk about the very hot, very new and cool weight loss boot camp that we're about to launch. Hi Liliana, welcome. Hi Rena. All right, so you're going to tell us why do diets fail and why this amazing weight loss boot camp that you're launching is going to be different. So let's start with why do diets fail? Well, Rena, you know, 80% of diets fail uh, really after one year. And I would think that the biggest reason that I see with my patients is because they're expecting too much, too quick, too soon. So they lose interest before they actually achieve what we would consider a lifestyle change. That means become the change that they have been seeking. Now, also too, people think that calories in, calories out. So if they do a very low carbohydrate diet, they're for sure going, if by math, they're going to lose their weight. But what they don't understand that a lot of foods that they may be consuming are causing them allergenic reactions that's causing them inflammation, which mm -hmm. is holding on to their weight and water retention. Lots of people have endocrine disorders, whether it's their thyroid or their adrenals or their hormones, that can definitely impact their ability to lose weight as well. So there's a lot of factors. It's not about calories in, calories out. Uh, we know that there is a big difference between what we would consider low sugar foods, high sugar foods, mm -hmm. foods that are what we would consider franken fats and hydrogenated and chemicals. Those all play a huge role. And we know so many diet programs are with fake food. Yes. And so you've got a lot of, you know, Splenda and aspartame and, you know, sugar-free. And really, what do they do? They just tell your brain that they're looking for a calorie, but they're not getting one. So they keep you hungry all the time so that you can continue to buy these foods. So there's so much mixed information out on the media, low carb, high carb, ketogenic, yes. uh, vegan, that people are just really confused. And so one of the goals is, is to teach you how to create a chemistry so that you really understand your body as being a very unique body so that we can really achieve the goals based upon where you're at where you want to go for a lifetime i love it. you know you'd earlier mentioned when you were chatting that there's also a difference between not just the foods but also the stress and the workout and the program that you're putting together is sort of a 365 degree view of all the different things that need to be done. Talk a little bit about what are the other aspects that will be incorporated into this boot camp. Okay, so one of the things is it's two week boot camp. So I'm really going to condense so much material in a very short period of time. So what I really want is a lot of participation from everyone. And so I'll be able to help um, my clientele out there if they're able to give me some feedback. So really, I'm really looking for really a lot of team, you know, cooperation. So I can be able to, you know, when we do our coaching calls, be very specific about some of the challenges that we might have. Now, one of the things is, is that we're not going to re, uh, really be so much of a caloric restriction uh, protocol as we're going to be a sugar restriction. So I'm going to say, we're going to go into sugar rehab. Yeah, uh -huh. nobody likes to hear that because, you know, immediately they're thinking of all of their little, you know, tweets, you know, flying out the window. But honestly, there's so many foods that can fit into what we would consider tweets that aren't going to be offensive and cause us weight gain. So I really want to put uh, it out there that you don't have to give up flavor. You don't have to give up your favorite foods. But what we're going to do is turn them into foods that look the same but don't have the same impact as far as the glucose. So it's going to be a very uh, moderate protein, it's going to be a low to moderate carbohydrate, and a little bit higher in the fat, because fats are very satiating to the brain. People get um, the protein and fats, they get satiated very quickly, unlike when we eat carbohydrates and yes. we end up eating way too much before we even begin to feel full. Absolutely. Yeah, that sounds great. And of course, you're going to have uh, elements of stress management, including curated meditations, mindfulness, some yoga, some exercises. So for, for everyone out there, you know, this is a program that's going to help you get started on a journey that allows you to maintain the new lower weight, not just lose it temporarily for some upcoming event. Great. Liliana, thank you so much. We are looking forward to seeing the rest of you 
on the weight loss boot camp and keep an eye out for the upcoming series of question and answers with Liliana where she answers questions around the importance of exercise, how to read labels, and so much more. We'll see you on the next video.